I um, often am planning my classes late at night because I'm at school all day. Uh, and then I started working out that I could do really awesome transitions between uh, the all of them and that students thought they were funny. And I basically am looking for cheap laughs whenever I'm uh, giving lectures. And so I um, so, yeah, so they've become uh, sort of a thing where I started. Uh, now I have um, I have a Death Star blowing up in one of mine and um I can't even remember what other ones I've got. When uh, before I was here at Oakland, when I was a younger man, uh, beginning my career teaching, I used to worry a lot, a lot about dressing and looking like a professor. That is no longer a concern. But uh, you know, sometimes I'm in the classroom, in the, like the lecture hall, right? And uh, uh, but other times we're doing production courses, and I'm crawling around on the floor or lugging lots of equipment around. Um, so I suppose my look is some sort of combination of uh, practical yet professional. I really try to get more of a sort of um, a diversity, I think, a range of different types of films. It's a wonderful life. Hot dog. Something that both fits the historical or the conceptual uh, theme that we're working on that week. Peeping Tom. Sweet. Uh, but also something that helps to round out the students' exposure to different uh, types of films throughout the semester. Eternal sunshine of the spotless mind. Teach in every class. I love using social media in the classroom because it's a more interactive, participatory way to engage in concepts, think about what's going on, bring clips in, talk to other people. I've had students tweet at filmmakers or tweet at film companies and get responses or critics. So it's this really interesting way of bringing film and cinema out there into the classroom and then continuing the conversation from there. You should see me at the dinner table. Who's your favorite actress? Uh, you know, I really like the 1930s and 1940s. That's the period I study. Uh, yeah, there, but there are so many great actresses, it's really hard to choose. I mean, I really like Joan Crawford. Jean Harlow, who I really like. I'm a big fan of the film Only Angels Have Wings. Uh, I really like Betty Davis a lot. So there, it's really it's too, hard to, too hard to choose. Well, cause there's a rumor going around that Barbara Stanwyck is your favorite actress. Oh, really? Who have you heard that from? Everyone. That's really odd. I, I don't know how anyone would think I'm a fan of Barbara Stanwyck. Uh, I don't know, I mean, show her movies in class, perhaps? I've shown a few of her films, but uh, it's just really odd. I'd really like to know who you heard that from. Literally uh, everybody. Hmm. Do you mind if I step out for a minute? Of course. Okay. I've got to talk to somebody. Thank you. Yes, I'm sorry. Yeah.